and welcome to the arena in Verona for a gala concert to help the hungry in Africa. My friends and colleagues from the International Opera World joined forces to make this a very special event and I am thrilled to be able to present this program to you. Verona is famous for its summer festival of opera. More than 20,000 people can be seated in this Roman amphitheater and the performances under the stars always have a unique atmosphere. It seemed a natural choice, therefore, for my friend Jose Carreras to select this location for the opera singer's equivalent to Bob Geldof's Band-Aid concert. Buonasera, signore e signori. Benvenuti a Verona, benvenuti all'Arena, benvenuti a questo nostro gala benefico Opera per l'Africa. Uh, Jose is welcoming everyone to the arena and thanking the artists and orchestras for giving their services. The program begins with an historic event. Giuseppe Di Stefano, one of the greatest tenors of the century, has agreed to make a rare appearance to sing before his public again. Jose has just told us that he has idolized Di Stefano all his life and is thrilled to have him on this program. Giuseppe Di Stefano. Giuseppe is going to sing one of the popular songs that he has always loved to perform. Giardino sponte, 
what an emotional start to Opera for Africa to set it Stefano on stage again. And now it gives me great pleasure to introduce our own Rosalind Plowright and the Italian baritone Renato Brusson, who will sing a duet from Verdi's Il Trovatore. Oh, my God. 
Jasmine Flowright, Ronato Brisson, together with the conductor Carlo Franchi, after the act for duet from Il Trovatore. One of the most exciting performances to be seen on stage today is Agnes Walzer's Carmen. From Bizet's popular masterpiece, she is going to sing the Seguidilla. from Carmen. Thank you, Agnes Balzer. Our next performer is Giorgio Zancanaro. You may have seen him recently on television in Andre Chenier and Don Carlo. Tonight he's going to sing the aria Eri Tu from Verdi's Un Ballo in Maschera. Oh, oh, oh. 
Zanconaro, who lives here in Verona, has just sung Airy Two from the Mask Ball by Verdi. Now we are going to hear the Russian soprano Natalia Trotskaya, a relatively new voice to the West. She sings the famous Visi d'Arte from Puccini's Tosca. I have lived for art, I have lived for love.
Natalia Trotskaya, who gave us Visi Darte from Tosca. Now a change of mood from the drama of Italian opera to the world of Johann Sebastian Bach. The Bulgarian pianist Alexis Weissenberg is going to play Bach's Jesu Gleide Meine Freude, known to us as Jesu Joy of Man's Desiring. Jesu joy of man's desiring. Even here in this vast arena, the sensitive playing of Alexis Weissenberg created a truly magical atmosphere. Some of my colleagues who were unable to come to Verona recorded personal messages for us. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Placido Domingo talking to you from San Francisco, the west coast of the United States. I'm sorry that I cannot be in Verona today with you because I know that all my colleagues 
and all the singers are singing for a very noble cause, which it is for the hungry people in Africa. The relief of this hunger is something that it should be so important for every one of us. And for us, we do it singing because we try to bring peace and serenity to people with our singing. So my voice would be there even if I cannot be there. I wish to everybody a very, very happy day and I hope that the public enjoy it very much. time to my knowledge that a group of opera singers have assembled together to give a concert to help raise money to feed the people who are starving in Africa. I think it's a, a great accomplishment. It's the operatic Woodstock of the world and I'm happy to be able to participate in this. Oh, the folks work on the mesa 
live performances in the arena of Verona. Here comes tonight's second conductor Robert Patinostro with Polish soprano De Swawe Dona. She is going to sing the Queen of the Night second aria from the Magic Flute. Thank you. 
After this performance, one can understand why the Suave Donut is world famous for her Queen of the Night. Now we're going to hear the death scene of the Marquis of Tosa from Verdi's opera Don Carlo. To sing it, here is my Spanish colleague, Baritone Juan Pons. For my first appearance this evening, I chose the aria in Questo Regio from Puccini's Turandot. The icy princess proclaims her rejection of love and death to any suitor unable to solve her riddles.
Jose Carreras to sing an aria from Umberto Giordano's opera about the French Revolution, André Chenier.
This is just sung the aria in D al Azzurro Spazio from Andre Shinmi. Now he is returning with his compatriot, the Spanish soprano Montserrat Caballé. They are going to sing together the Bring the Sea or Drinking Song from Verdi's La Traviata. Jose is inviting the audience to join them as we are without a chorus tonight. Gradiremo moltissimo se voi potete fare, se potete cantare con noi questo brindisi della Traviata. Montserrat Caballé, Carol Franchi, and the audience in the arena have just performed the Brindisi from La Traviata. And now to a popular work written this century, 
Leonard Bernstein's West Side Story. And we have America's own Sharon Mills to sing the hauntingly beautiful Maria. delighted when my friend Andrew Lloyd Webber agreed to come to Verona and accepted my suggestion to make his debut as a conductor. He is going to direct the Pia Jesu from his requiem. The soloists are his lovely wife Sarah Brightman and Paul Miles Kingston. And as you can see, a group of our soloists agreed to make up the chorus.
adore this beautiful PA Yezu from Andrew Lloyd Webber's Requiem. Our entire family is also crazy about the musical Cats. So when asked to sing something on the lighter side, memory was my obvious choice. Now return to the music of Verdi, which is so closely associated with performances in this arena. 
Ingvar Wicksell will sing an aria from Rigoletto. Rigoletto's daughter has just been kidnapped. He suspects his enemies, the Mantuan courtiers, and pleads with them for her release. by the Swedish baritone Ingvar Wittsel. And now another change of pace. Music from the Johann Strauss operetta Die Fledemaus.
Armenian soprano Sona Gazarian. Now we are going to hear one of the finest bass voices before the public today, the Russian Evgeny Nestorenko. He's going to sing the aria about the power of slander from Rossini's Barber of Seville. Oh, 
Arsenal, alla fin della banca Spagna si propaga, si raddoppia e produce un'esplosione. Come un colpo di cannone. Come un colpo di cannone. Un tremoto temporale, un tremoto temporale, un tremoto temporale che fa l'aria di compagno. Un tremoto temporale, un tremoto temporale, un tremoto temporale che fa l'aria di compagno. Dorenko has just sung La Colonia from the Barber of Seville. Here is Sharon Mills to sing the prologue from Leon Cavallo's I Pagliacci. Oh, 
from E. Pagliacci. Now here is Montserrat Caballé to sing one of the truly great arias in opera, Casta Diva from Bellini's Norma.
Ask the Diva, beautifully sung by Montserrat Caballé. We now return to the musical Verdi and the Italian baritone Renato Brusson.
opera for Africa was the idea of Jose Carreras, and so it's appropriate that he sings the last solo, a popular Neapolitan song. Carreras is asking all the artists to join him on stage for the finale. So it's good night from the arena in Verona and from me, Gwyneth Jones, and I leave the final word to Jose Carreras. Because the big finale with all of us singing the Vapentiero chorus from Verdi's Nabucco, I would like to thank you all, my colleagues, for their generosity, and you, of course, for being here with us tonight. Thank you. Thank you very much.